Yo, yo, yo. Welcome. Welcome, Joe Fit Johnson fam. It's your boy, Joe Fit Johnson, back at it to bring you guys some fire content. You already know what it is. I'm going to be breaking down how you can set up your DeFi wallet so you can get you a Cryptos, Kronos chimp. I just got my first chimp. Um, this is not financial advice. You don't even have to get this chimp, but this is just how you set up your wallet so that you're able to purchase NFTs on the Kronos chain on using CRO. Um, the Kronos chimps are just, you know, chimps that are now the first chimp to sell out on this on this um 10,000 first launch first one two <sighs> this is my second time making this video my first one got deleted I'm like ah! so bear with me y'all I'm gonna be stepping y'all through it if you don't know what this channel is I am not a crypto expert this channel is not all about crypto but I do talk financial literacy investments crypto real estate uh, building wealth in your mind, building wealth in your body, building wealth in your soul, you feel me? So it's fitness, health, mindset, you know, wealth, abundance, right? So we're all about that. Like I said, I live downtown, bear with me, you might hear some sirens in the back, you might hear some yelling, it gets on and cracking down here, you feel me? So bear with me, it's a little noise in the back, I'm trying to do my best, I got a mic set up, so yeah. Um, so let's get into it, let's get into it. I bought my first NFT, I bought my first NFT on, on the Kronos Chimp Club, all right? So just a quick little breakdown of what the Kronos Chimp Club is, um, I'll do another section of this, but pretty much it's the first um, NFT on the Kronos blockchain, which is using the CRO token, which is crypto.com's token, right? So if you don't know, not, you probably don't know, but I live a few blocks away from the Staples Center, right? Staples Center was just, um, on the December 25th, is going to be officially changing the name from Staples Center to crypto.com, right? So I'm starting to see some advertising around the Staples Center it's saying crypto.com, I'm like, whoa, this is real life. So I've had crypto.com for a few years now. Um, that's where I've been buying my, my crypto from. So it's it's awesome to see that, you know, this is the first NFT drop. They sold out of 10,000 of their cha their champs. So, um, I, and they have a great community. They have a great plan. They're gonna be building a metaverse. They're gonna be, you know what I mean, having NFTs um, all on this Kronos blockchain. This Kronos blockchain is able to accept, um, you know, different tokens because it is a, um, I did a little bit of my research. It is EVM compatible. So it's built on Ethermint, which supports a rapid porting app of smart contracts from Ethereum and other EVM comparable chains. All right, so this is gonna allow um, better use for Ethereum. It's gonna be cheaper. It's gonna be able to transact more and it's gonna be able to do more for Ethereum because it has that capability, all right? I bet. So let's get it popping. All right. First step first, you're going to go to your app store. You're going to go, whether you're on Android, whether you're on Apple, you're going to download crypto.com's DeFi wallet. All right. So you're going to download that, right? Let that render, let that load up. You're going to get that downloaded. You're going to open it up and you are going to set up your account. You're going to set up your, um, <clears throat> your wallet, right? So in order to set up your wallet, first step is going to ask you to accept the user agreement. You're going to go through that, make sure that you read it. Um, you're going to mark both of the boxes. And then you're also going to make sure that you set up your passphrase, your seed phrase. Um, you can set up two-factor authentication. I'm not going to do that right now, but you will set that up via your authenticator. I'll have another video on how to set up an authenticator, um, but very basic stuff. Um, but yeah, it's pretty much Google Authenticators to set up your two-step verification. Um, next is gonna be setting up your seed phrase. So whenever you're setting up a DeFi wallet, whether that be you know, uh, on Crypto's DeFi wallet, whether that be on the Nano external hard drive wallet, whether that be on MetaMask, you're always gonna have a seed phrase. The seed phrase is really, really important. You don't wanna put this online at all. You don't want to give anybody access to it. You don't want anybody to know about it. You don't wanna put it in your notes, in your Google. You don't wanna write it down online where hackers can get access to it because if somebody gets access to this, they can wipe your account dry, right? This is what you're gonna to use to recover if you were to lose, you know what I mean, access to your wallet or, you know what I mean, lose it, you're able to back it up via the seed phrase. So the seed phrase is very, very important. You wanna make sure that you write it down, store it somewhere safely, maybe in a deed, I mean, in a um, in a box, in a motherfucking will, in a motherfucking lock it up. Lock it up somewhere that you, that, that you trust. Um, and then after that, you're gonna be in, right? After you're in, you wanna sync and connect your crypto.com app to your crypto DeFi wallet. This is super important. This allows the crypto.com finances to just 
get externally um, exported into um, crypto.com's DeFi wallet of course you're gonna have to authenticate it's gonna ask you to authenticate via your email first all right so you're gonna put in your email it's gonna send you over a email um, to confirm after you get that done then you're gonna confirm it via the email make sure you get the emails always from crypto.com it's not from someone pretending to be crypto.com um, that's something that I always recommend you're gonna put your password in and then you're in next you're going to transfer your crypto.com CRO coins that you've purchased in crypto.com and you're gonna transfer it to this DeFi wallet all right this is gonna make it so that you're able to purchase these NFTs and so that it's stored in the DeFi wallet because that's the first step so yeah you can buy it in crypto.com um, you can also buy it in the DeFi wallet you can also trade your coins for it if you have other tokens um, so yeah there's a couple of different options when it comes to that and now we're going to take our crypto.com CRO and transfer it to our DeFi wallet alright so you, you must already you see here already have 951 CRO alright I'm gonna transfer about six I'm gonna transfer about the max that I can transfer out is 600 and that's because 200 of it is put in um, I'm gonna show you a bit later but 200 of it's currently held in my unlock so I transferred 601 CRO coins over um, it still shows that I have some left but I can't send them because they're locked in their promotion um, so I have to get that unlocked I'll show you guys how to do that later we're gonna send that over after you send it over you confirm it's gonna ask you to send over the uh, the confirmation from your Google Authenticator so you just want to make sure you put that code in exactly as it's shown and then hit continue and then hit continue so now we see that it's gone and it's gonna take a few minutes to get into our crypto.com wallet I'm just gonna show you quick why some of it's held and locked. You see, I have 300, about 350 CRO locked as the sign-up bonus. So in order to unlock that, I have to stake 400 CRO and unlock the metal crypto Visa card. So it's kind of like you you gotta pay to play. Um, so I guess I've had that since I originally opened it, and $25 has went to $300. So I got to get that unlocked. I'm going to put 400 CRO in there and stake it. When you're staking it, you're getting about 12% interest back. So not too bad. Um, so yeah, if you just got money sitting in the bank, might as well stake it anyways. Um, I have, I, I currently have ADA staked in a Cardano pool. Um, so yeah, and I'm earning about 5 to 6% interest on that for all of my, all of my coins. So that's pretty cool. Um, so yeah, from there, we wait. We've just exported our money and put it into our crypto DeFi wallet, right? So from there, we wait for the money to reflect in our DeFi wallet. So let's go shopping, give it some time. So when you're looking for these um, these chimps, um, I spent some time on the the live the other day and just kind of like to general knowledge, like you want to go for things that not only like look cool to you, like that's. That's what I feel like matters most. Like things that like look cool, but really what they say are the traits as well. So the traits rarity. So when it says like example, you know, this has 10.2 trait, like that's a basic trait, but then when it has like 1.2 or um, 2.5, that means that only 2.5% of out of um, 10,000 chimps has that trait, right? So 1.2% out of 10,000 chimps have that trait, so about 120, I, I believe, right? Something like that. Um, so the more rare the traits, the, the more value, essentially. Um, but I also think, you know, it's, it's a matter of what looks cool as well. So I definitely went for some that, I mean, my chimp has some, some cool traits. Um, the one that I decided to get, I, I was trying to go for this other one, but it sold before I could get it. But I kind of like this little guy with the, the ninja, the, the, I, I believe the mask is gonna be a, a statement in our history. So in three to five years, you know what I mean? the whole mass situation is, is something that like was super impactful to our world so i think having that and then he's kind of like in a france as well and he's like a prisoner so i feel like there's kind of a little story behind that and i own him so i might make my own story fucking dumb about so yeah i feel like the value is in the eye of the beholder you know what i'm saying like yeah there's traits but it's also about like what looks cool to you you know what you value it at and what you're going to sell it at i mean 
what really stands out to me and we'll dive a little bit deeper into this in terms of like what um crypto champs plan is with the metaverse with nfts and um the plan is and the plan is to have a metaverse right so um chronos is going to essentially have its own metaverse using the cro cro token as well as i believe that these chimps are going to be implemented into this metaverse so um i bought a character for a metaverse right so that that's something that's really cool to me and one of the reasons i bought it um because it is one of the first well it is the first on this blockchain to sell out ten thousand completely i mean yeah ten thousand chimps completely um and it's the first of this chain and it's really cool art so there's no telling where this can go in, in my opinion you know so um and if i'm gonna just have money sitting in crypto anyways i might as well get one an nft moonzir sunsex torrents yours is coming next my g um definitely need that but yeah you see i have 601 cro so i'm gonna have to buy some more so right now i'm just buying some more through the DeFi wallet um i'm buying about 200 more so that i have enough for this chimp so i just put in my card info bought it now i'm waiting for it to reflect all right <clears throat> So I pretty much went through, bought that, put in my passcode, um, and then I'm waiting for the balance to show the 811 CRO. So that's about 500, 560 I paid about for my trim. That's not bad. I'm not mad at that. Um, so yeah, I'm transferring my, okay, we, we gotta go over this part. All right, so what we have to do is we have to now do the Kronos Bridge. So we're now taking the uh, CRO token and putting it onto the blockchain of um, Kronos Bridge. So you have to do this in order to have the balance reflect in the marketplace. Um, I was struggling with this for a little bit because I was like, why is it only showing that I have 200 in my marketplace? Um, but I wasn't, uh, I didn't transfer it over through the Kronos Bridge. So yeah, transfer it over now. Now you can shop, now we live, baby. So um, this is the one I gravitated towards first. Um, so adopt the chimp, you can rank it, you know, low to high, high to low, by different traits, different filters, things like that, which is cool. Um, so yeah, my little guy, I'm thinking about, I'm, so I was gravitated towards at first, like I, I was, but at the same time, it's like, there's so many cool ones, like I want more, you know what I mean? But it's like, ah, I don't know if I should keep, my bad, fly. I don't know if I should keep, you know what I mean? Keep buying them. Um, maybe I'll trade some coins over and get one more. Um, if there's a nice dip, I might get another one. Um, when there's a nice dip, I may get another one. But yeah, I'm also trying to diversify. So here, you see that my guy has 2.9%, um, 35 3.6, 10, 10, 3. So that's not bad, but I think I can go for some some more rare traits. So I may try to just quick flip them and then just uh, collect a, a more rare one, the one that looks a little bit more crazy, because that's it's kind of who I am. This guy looks a little simple for me, low key, but it was one that I gravitated towards. So I'm like, let me just go with my gut. But at the same time, I could go for one that looks a little goofy. Um, I could definitely go for one that looks a little crazy. Yeah. Um, so I might just try to flip them quick and then get one that looks a little cooler, but I would be so sad if he ends up being a gym. So let's look at some of the other guys. I'll let you guys do your own market research, but this guy had five traits, threes in single digits. This guy has three in single digits, five traits. Five traits, so I don't know if it's better to have more traits or less traits. But this guy only got five, and he's, he's pretty low as well, so I mean, it kind of just, it's up to your discernment. You can go by the traits, you can go by what you think looks cool, what you want to collect. Um, I think either way, we're so new that, and so early on that, I don't think we're going to be losing money, especially if you don't sell it when it's low. Like, that's just, that's the only way you lose, right? So, let's buy this bad boy. So, we're going to go, we're going to go buy chimp. All right, confirm, confirm. And now, he's in the wallet, right? So, once he's in the um, the marketplace wallet, you can go to. Dang it! Hold up. So after you confirm it, you can go to view my chimps, and that's where you'll see all your chimps. From there, you can ex ex export it to another external drive. 
um, to a MetaMask or something outside or to your DeFi wallet, probably in your DeFi wallet. Let's not confuse you too much. Then you can put that onto your Nano, which would make it most most protected. But I just listed mine for a high price. Y'all gonna get used to seeing this mug on the high high tier marketplace. So we're gonna rake them for some high money. And yeah, let him sit up there and get some recognition because that's what he deserves. I feel like it's all in the, in the eye of the beholder. Like I be seeing some chimps up there priced crazy, but their traits aren't crazy. So it's like, maybe somebody's like, oh, this dude looks cool. He's a pretty, like, I don't know. Um, so yeah, that's that's pretty much pretty much it, y'all. You just bought a champ if you want to buy a champ. Um, I, I'm really interested to see where this is going to go with this CRO um, coin and the Kronos blockchain, you know, um, being able to accept smart contracts and things like that. It really looks like it could be a, um, I mean, and it's just like crypto.com is one of the fastest, most innovative and most fastest growing uh, crypto platforms that there is, you know what I mean? So I think I, I think there's really a, some, some power behind it. I think there's really a great chance to do some great things. So I'm definitely gonna start, you know, making sure I stock up on the CRO token. I definitely had some from back when I first opened up um, crypto.com but I'm not heavy in it like I should be so I'm gonna definitely get heavy in it just because I know that with they that they have plans with the metaverse they have plans with NFT so it's like buy it right now why it's at 69 cents you know what I'm saying so in, in a few months in a few years you know as they develop their market I mean their metaverse and NFTs and things like that like it's only gonna grow you know so red means buy <laughs> all right so I hope this um, helped y'all give me a like give me a comment give me a subscribe um, drop in the uh, <laughs> drop below if you own a chimp if you are a chimp squad um, if not let me know if you have any questions let me know if this helped you um, and yeah much love Joe Fit Johnson game no let's try something different uh, yeah much love y'all shit Joe Fit Johnson game what do you know about that dang I might have a different name each time um, but I'm about to edit this up I'm gonna get this up as fast as possible